Welcome back to the channel, everyone. My name is Darth Sloan, your official partnered content creator for Expansive Worlds. Just out here doing a little fishing for some common carp. But the purpose of today's video is not the common carp, but a big old mirror carp. El Matador, to be more precise. And guess where he's at? <laughs> we got a bunch of people right here going for him. Looks like Alpine Gaming Australia is going for him. Tiger Dad going for him. Bunch of people. This is the area that he's at right here. I caught him earlier. I uh, didn't take long at all to catch him, and I'll be dropping that in there. Let's have a look at him. I'll be dropping my footage after this. Before we hop into it, though, guys, if you would, hit that like, subscribe, notify bell. Really helps the channel out, and we've been growing. I appreciate each and every one of you commenting on those videos, hitting that like button, and, and the notify bell if you've already done so much appreciated you guys are rock stars thank you so much for the continued support now let's hop on into it here el matador 89.71 pounds we thought that it was going to be the biggest fish on the game there must have been some uh miscommunication there or uh, maybe just the biggest fish on on spain we, we thought that he was going to be the biggest fish in the game thought we had heard something about that uh, so everybody was expecting it to be bigger than 110 pounds because that's what Sidewinder is, but it's 89.71 pounds, over four foot in length, and the bait and lure preference is cheese, boilies, natural, which is what I caught him on, artificial corn, yellow, and if you hit tab, imitation dog biscuits as well. But the first person to catch him in the official angler discord was... Uh, I forget his name, but he caught him on, he or she, caught it on a two-alt bottom fishing with natural boilies. So, of course, what does everybody do? Well, we know that works. It's already been caught on that. So that's what they, what everybody used. Same for me. Now, I've heard that on the Facebook official angler discord or the Facebook I don't know if it's official or not, but the Facebook, the Angler Discord, I've heard that he has been caught on 3 aught and 4 aught, but we knew it was caught on 2 aught, so you go with what you know at the time, right? Ed Kiefer was reeling on, there was a bunch of us there fishing. I have actually have a screenshot that I'll throw up in this video. Let's do that right now, actually. Six of us holding El Matador. All right, there you go, guys. Look at that screenshot there. Dre talk holding him. Maniac, that's Ed Kiefer. Six shot rebel. Fatness, Amy the Hunters, and Toasty out there. I had already caught mine, and the plan was I was going to turn around in my boat and get them all in the background holding it. And when I hit enter to accept mine, I crashed. So I had to actually come back in here and, and wait on these guys to catch it. And at least I got this picture of the six of them holding that we had a great time out there fishing during my subathon so oh one more thing let's look at the traits on el matador because one of them is very interesting i want to talk about all right we've got bottom lurker we've got hard fighter he really fought the hardest once i got him to the boat it was like really not that good of a fight and then when he got close to the boat it was he took me back out over 100 feet again but let's look at superiority complex. Now this is um, basically aggressive. So we'll bite eagerly and willingly knowing it will emerge victorious. It didn't take long to get him to bite for me. Not very many casts at all. But here's one thing to note. If you just want to catch El Matador and you don't want to catch any others, if you don't want to catch Common Cart or Mirror Cart and you just want El Matador, he does not nibble. Okay, remember that. He does not nibble. So if you get a nibble, it's not him. So you can either like cut the line or just choose to not set the hook and just sit there and wait or recast whatever you want to do because he strikes immediately. He does not nibble. So I just figured I'd throw that out there for you guys. So let's look at my setup, what I caught him on. The Citro Del Rey. 
110 strength, max line strength, 66.14 pounds. Now here's your decision you gotta make. Do you wanna use the fluorocarbon 66.14 pound line and have less line on your reel or do you wanna go with the braided? See, I had the Tiff Talker and here's the braided line. I dropped down to the 60.63 pounds so that I could have, see the diameter is 0 0.016. So the diameter is smaller. You're able to put more line onto the reel. Now that I've caught him once, I'll go ahead and tell you guys, it really don't matter. You can go with that braided if you want. I guess it depends on how big of a rod and reel you've got. It wasn't that big of a fight, honestly. Uh, you could probably go with the 66 pound fluorocarbon if you wanted to. Either way, he didn't. He didn't take me out that far, actually. So it wasn't that wasn't that big a deal. And then you got the two alt hook, and then I just used, I actually used the boy lease, two alt and boy lease, because that's what the first guy that caught him used. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to leave you with the footage, show you that he does not nibble. We'll get it from beginning to end. Let you look at it and see how long the fight was. It was not that long of a fight at all. And you guys can see exactly where I caught him. Once again, on the map, right down here where everybody's at right now, that's where I caught him about riding through here where these two people are. But I would just come here to Pate de Flamenco, summon a vehicle, Go up here, summon a boat, and park right here where these guys are. Cast around there. It didn't take me long at all. I'll drop that footage in now, guys, and you guys let me know in the comments. Did you struggle? What'd you catch him on? Did any of you catch him on a three alt or a four alt? Did you use a different bait than the boilies? Let me know in the comments, guys. I appreciate you. Drop the footage in right now. Yeah, it's right here. Right here where the party's at. <laughs> Look on your map and where there's... 10 out of the 10 people. Oh, Three shoot. Go, we got him on. You got him on? We got something on. Now, are you still using the two watt? Yeah. How's the fight on it? Because I, no I noticed mine that Silva didn't have the fight that I expected. Uh, well, this may not be him. Yeah, that's why I went up to a 3 watt. Everybody's catching him on two alt though. The two that we know that have been caught. Yeah. Jaden said he had harder fights from Diamond Commons. It's, this may or may not be him. I don't know. Yeah, well, that's what I thought. Cause I've, I've gotten some nice America, you know, no diamonds or anything. Some silver and gold to put up one heck of a fight. This one was nothing to it. That last one I brought in. I don't think this is him. Did you full cast when you caught whatever year? When you hooked whatever year? No, about a half cast. But I don't think this is him. I think I've caught like a air carp or a common. You were on 100% drag for most of the fight. There's no way. I mean, this is, I'm at 55% drag. He's not even turning me cherry red. This yeah, all the way mine was. I was up to 80% drag and it was only like half the buy pink. If I knew that he would buy a three alt, and I don't know why he wouldn't, I would switch to a three alt. Yeah, well, that's what I'm doing. I'm on the three alt now, and I'm not getting anything. I don't know why he wouldn't buy the three alt. Yeah, I just don't think there's any world that he doesn't. I'm on a three all three right now with a boilie. Do you have him hooked? This is him. Yeah, you got him. Yep, I can. This is him. Uh, it's not as big of a fight as I was expecting. Now I'm using the big bottom feeder rod in the tee off top level 90 reel. I don't know if that matters or not. Now all of a sudden he decides he wants to fight. After you let me reel him all the way to the boat. It was easy until then. Now he's already got me out past 90 again.
Well, two alt boilies. He's yeah, got me out past a hundred again. It's like it was easy until he saw the boat. Nice, Arliss. Anybody that has him caught right now, if you want to hold him, I mean, it's up to you if you want to. But if you if you want to hold him, I'd, I would like to get a picture of everybody with him, you know, holding him out. If anybody wants to just hold him for a second, let me get this guy reeled in. Where'd you get your drag at? Mine's at 70 right now. Yeah, and he's not budging it. Yeah, I'm at 80 and he's hanging right there, right, just over 150. Get in my boat! You big fat lord! I'm up to 100 drag now. Have y'all caught the other legendaries? Get the burn button. I just think gonna go for that. No, yeah. because I love you. I worked until 11 o'clock last night, so I could take today off. Yeah. There you go. I'm under 100 feet now. 89.71 pounds. Hope oh, somebody else is hooked up to him. Is that you, Ed? Yeah, I'm hooked on to something. Oh, that's him. I can see him swimming. Assuming you're yeah, right to my left. Yeah, it, 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 yeah, yeah, my game name is Maniac. Yeah, I just can't tell. Here I can tell. Uh, I just crashed. All right, guys. There was my encounter with El Matador. Please let me know. How did it go for you? What Did you catch him on a smaller pole? I've heard people caught him with the graduation pole. Uh, this is the one that you buy off from Spain. And a lot of people don't realize that when you go into the souvenir shop on Spain, it's actually not in the equipment tab where all the other poles and reels and stuff are. It's actually in the very first tab. Not really sure why it's in the local souvenirs there. Not really sure why it's on that side. I don't know if that was by design or what, but that's why a lot of people didn't know about this pole. But this is the biggest bottom fishing pole that you can get out there, the Citro del Rey what i caught him on let me know what your setup was did you have any trouble getting him to bite did i get lucky sidewinder is my nemesis i'll go ahead and tell you i don't even go for sidewinder um, because i sat there i gave him 30 minutes today and never bit people beside me got him to bite i would rather be catching fish and getting xp than sitting there for 30 minutes waiting on a fish to bite and i've been lucky with sidewinder before and had him bite in 10 15 minutes other times I've sat there for 30, I'll get, I usually give him chunks at a time, 30 minutes at a time. But right now, if I was probably already a level 100, I would sit there and do it if, if I wouldn't need an XP and stuff. But I'm almost to level 98. I would rather be doing challenges, catching fish, leveling up than sitting there not doing, not getting any XP for 30 minutes. So I just can't justify doing it. But anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for checking out my encounter with el matador and i look forward to what's going to happen next week you know what's the rotation going to be like now that we've seen all three we're seeing it mixed up you know we got hendrick again here kpd we've not seen in a minute so it's kind of getting you know jumbled up hopefully we get kpd next week uh, but it's it's not been set in stone like it was before do me a favor hit that like subscribe notify bell guys let me know once again, in the comments, what you think about the new Legendary, and if you had any trouble, if you thought it was easy, let me know if you have any ideas for a future video you'd like to see me make. I've been taking requests lately. I did the new beginner guide setup video based off of a request. Uh, if there's any guides out there you'd like to see, you know, any other types of videos, let me know. Look, always looking for ideas. We appreciate you guys. My name is Dar Sloan. We'll catch you in the next video.